Hello, what is up guys? It's Deco Kiro here and today I'm going to bring you all with me to grab some dinner. Well, I also wish uh, we wish our place called Warum Nusantara in the husband, so I guess we have to do this sign thing for a bit before starting our dinner. So my drink has arrived. Oh, yeah. uh, so we are at Warung Nusantara right now, as I show you earlier. Yeah. So tonight I start with something simple, uh, which is the korok mee, and also the uh, kombi fried rice or nasi goreng kombi. Uh, I like nasi goreng kombi over here actually. Over uh, compared to a lot of places, I will show you when I try it. It's actually quite nice. So this is our kombi fried rice over here. It actually arrived uh, really fast. It hasn't been five minutes that I ordered my kombi fried rice. So we arrived in my table. So we have here some eggs. Quite red, Lisa, which is quite nice. So since the audio of this part of the video is quite noisy in the background, I'm going to do some voiceover. So this mikolok is basically beef style mikolok and then the meat is actually quite dry today compared to the usual one that I had before. Um, for this one, I would say that it is fine. It's not that super good. I will rate it 6 out of 10. But then like if you want mikolok late night, you can just go here to satisfy your craving, I guess. So yeah. Alright, so we done this place. Like uh, the best thing about the place is like the price are relatively cheap, though. Maybe except for the kombi fried rice, but the kombi fried rice usually costs a lot. So since we are in like Icom Square, how about we try something nearby as well for our dinner number two? So this is a uh, izakaya. I wonder if I can get a table inside and then ask them permission to record myself while eating food. Let's see what is happening over here. It says we're open every day until 8.30 p.m. for dine-in and take away. So their timing is until 8.30 p.m. during this uh, lockdown period thing. Yeah, so we're in Izekaya right now. They have this kind of like unique sitting places that I kind of like. It's like from outside, it can make you look that you're sitting on a floor, but you're not. You have to take off your shoes and go inside to this whole thing. And then you just sit here like you're sitting like normal. So this is the dinner set thing. I'm not sure what should I order tonight. Let's put our camera over here for a bit. You can see we actually have some kind of like nice uh, Japanese team background with a bamboo and then like all these doors up there and like sometimes. It's like this one is like not as creepy as the some kind of like dolls. Uh, Japanese dolls are really look very creepy. Maybe because like I think it's like two years ago or was it last year? There's like this uh Doll Ghost Gold games in uh, Android phone or something. Was it only Android? I'm not sure as well, but then the, it was damn creepy. You should check it out as well if you want to uh, know what I'm talking about. So, uh, I hope you all can hear whatever I say. I already asked for permission that they say that I can actually record myself while eating. And there's like not as many people tonight. So. Uh, at least I don't feel that embarrassed while trying to talk to a camera and being awkward over here. Alright, so there you go. I was supreme much I think that I ordered just now. It looks alright. Um, I'm not sure, but the uh, ice is a little bit tougher. I mean, a little bit coarse than I expected. But other than that, yeah, there you go. This is soy sauce and then your, uh, your green tea. I ordered ice cream tea because I don't really like hot stuff that much uh, especially when the weather is a little bit hot but then it was raining today so that's not an excuse um, so 
Let's try this thing. So we have our shave ice over here. Yeah, this ice is a little bit tough. But let's see how it tastes like. Yeah, the taste is fine actually. Uh, a little better if the ice is a little bit more fine, but mm. Yeah, it works. I have ice cream on top, a red bean in the middle, some nuts, so I'm not sure is it peanuts or is it... Mm. I'm not sure about these nuts. Maybe we should go eat some kind of snow ice later on for our dessert number two. So this is our gyoza just now, so we just arrived, let's see how crispy the skin is. We just grab one. And then a bad chopstick skin on number one. Hmm. This one gyoza? Let's take a bite. Quite crispy, quite good. Actually, quite delicious. Hmm? Yeah, I can do that for my uh, side dish, for my main dish later on. But before that, as a responsible adult, I'm gonna eat my dessert before I eat my actual dinner. So our dinner set has arrived. Let's see what we have over here inside this plate. What is this? Some kind of like is it? Oh, it's tempura palm thing. It's quite cool. Quite crispy. Let me get this thing. Hmm. Oh, that was really nice. We have the usual um salad there and our chicken over here. Let's see. Ooh, very juicy, guys. Right? Ah, chicken juicy, quite good, quite good. I was actually a little bit confused about this thing. I was like wondering, is it like Japanese cream tea inside? But now, um, can't really see it, but it's actually miso soup inside. And then we have a lemon, I'm not sure what to do with that with. And some tempoyaki, and hmm, what is this thing? Actually, what is this thing? Probably some mochi, let me try it. Use is probably either mochi or like some kind of like green tea. Oh, it's green tea mochi with red bean paste inside. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Should I eat first because I still have my chef ice thing. My gyoza whole thing over here, so I probably try to eat the dinner first and let my ice cream a little bit melt. Gonna melt it a bit more. So let's set up for our dinner. Let's take a at this chicken skin thing that is really nice looking in this. Oh that's a really nice chicken roll. Before that's quite good, but quite nice change of pace. That is how to bring this soup out of this thing. I guess I can do this, it may work. Now, 
I'm gonna get more confused. I guess I need this like soup. Sauce for the chicken? Probably is this one. How do you have to do with this? I think this is what it's for actually. Oh, I guess that's actually for the chickens. Look, it actually get even more juicier than before. It's right now. Or was it actually for the tempura? I'm actually quite confused, but I let's try that as well. Do this, do this. Hmm, I'm not sure. Let's try this one. Sweet and salt, yeah, I didn't expect that. Actually, for the dinner set so far, I'm actually quite impressed by it. Since I introduced, um, taste that we don't expect. The next thing that confuses me, what does this lemon do over here? Like, what should I put lemon on? If you know where you should I put the lemon on, maybe you can just uh. Leave it inside the comment down below to teach me how to actually eat all these things. If you all actually know how to eat these things, because I'm pretty sure I'm butchering everything. Like maybe I should eat this with this, or like I should eat this with I don't know, like eat more with rice or something. I still remember like last time when I actually watched YouTube. I actually watched a lot of YouTuber eating. There is someone that actually go to Malaysia, like um, international, I mean, outside the people, like international people, huh. mm, foreigner, yeah, that's the word, like go to Malaysia eating roti canai, and then what I saw, like, he was eating that roti canai, um, the pastry of the roti canai first, and then he drink the curry like he drinks soup, which is quite weird to me i guess like right now like when i eat all this thing with weird combination people will be going like i guess i understand his feeling now because i have totally no idea how to eat all this i'm just put everything together try the combination this and that so i guess it's not for me, like dipping roti chana inside the curry was kind of like second nature for me but for this, I'm still not sure like how can I eat them together Alright, so we are done with our dinner number 2 at Izakaya just now So what was the damage in that uh, restaurant? So for Izakaya, we paid around 68 ringgit and 20 cent um, Two ringgit for the ocha, which is quite alright. Uh, Eighteen ringgit for the uji supreme matcha thing. The dinner set bento for twenty nine ringgit. Sounds a little bit pricey for the bento set. However, the bento set was actually really worth it. I actually like the bento set quite a lot because it kind of introduced you to weird flavors, which I really like. Uh, in my food, especially like if I pay for quite a little bit more pricey uh, in term of in comparison to the usual food that uh, we eat on daily basis, so it's like kind of worth the experience. Uh, you may want to try it yourself as well. However, for the uh, 
Uji Matcha thing. I was not a fan of it because it's a little bit too coarse for my uh, taste. I would prefer it to be a little bit more fine and fluffy, if you know what I mean. So, for that um, fine and fluffy kind of thing, let's move to our next and final destination for tonight. Which I will show you in a while, alright. Oh, y'all, I have a bad news. Uh, the place closed tonight. Maybe it's already too late. I'm not sure as well what time they open and what time they close. I should have checked that. So I guess we're gonna go to this place next time then instead of tonight. So I'm sorry about that. I didn't check about it earlier. Um, so uh, so I guess I'll be going home for now. Um, if you like this video, please leave a like and comment down below where else I should be eating next time in Kuching as long as I can reach to this, uh, that place and as long as it's open I guess uh, but then if you want some more info or some kind of like suggestion or way to eat in Kuching you can also visit my uh, Instagram uh, my Instagram handle is at Zekokyo you can find my uh, food account over there and then um, let's see I will try to also make more food video uh, coming soon since it's already at the end of the semester I don't really have to do any kind of video for my students anymore so uh, I probably will make more food video maybe every weekly like uh, once a week or probably uh, once every few days so stay tuned uh, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel so see you guys next time bye all right just kidding y'all I still need one more thing Hi, Hello, uh, chocolate top ada? Seda, ice cream semua seda. Ah, uh, pie cheese seda? Ada. Ah, uh, satu? Ada lagi? Ah, iya, Jack. Okay, we're fun. Alright. Oh, so they don't have my chocolate top ice cream thing, so I'm ordering uh, the new cheese pie. Let's try that one out then. Hello. Alright, thanks. So this is their new cheese pie thing. Uh, I think it's uh, something called yuzu cheese pie. Um, since they don't have the ice cream, let's settle with this one then for our uh, dessert number two. Mm. I guess you can say these are some of the cheese. Probably the, I don't know, something called the yuzu thing. I mean, the skin is nice as usual, but the feeling's like, eh, it's fine, I guess. Alright, so yeah, it's getting late. Time for me to actually go home and eat something different next time. So stay tuned to my YouTube channel. Alright, bye.